Hello everyone, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we are going to see how to represent the Lilacy family with the help of floral formula. The floral formula for Lilacy family is represented as this. Now let's try to relate this formula with the characteristic features. The inflorescence type here is mostly zymose. Now it is represented by the letter BR, right? BR stands for bracted flowers. So these flowers, they have presence of bracts, that is small leaf-like structures at the base of the petiole. In the other two families we have discussed so far, that is Fabaceae family and Solanaceae family, there the presence of bract was not there. So they are e-bracted flowers, but these are bracted flowers, hence they are represented by BR. Now the flower type is bisexual and actinomorphic. So the symbols here, actinomorphic symbol, which means they are radially symmetrical. They can be divided into two equal halves on any plane. Their bisexual means presence of male and female reproductive structures, androecium and gynecium on the same flower. The perianth, so here the sepals and the tepals, that is cal calyx and the corolla, that is the sepals and the petals, they are in the fused form, that is they cannot be differentiated. Those are known as tepals or the perianth. There are six such tepals which is present in the 3 plus 3 arrangement. At times they are often united into tubes. Now they follow the valvet type of astivation. If we talk about the androecium, that is the male part, they have got six stamens which are again in the form of 3 plus 3 arrangement which are epitepalous which means that the androecium is fused or associated with the perianth. Hence this symbol or symbol of addition is shown over here. Now the gynecium or the female reproductive structure, they are triculpary, you can see over here, they are syncopers, they are fused and they have the ovary is superior and they are trirocular with many ovules. They follow the exile placentation. The, flu, the fruit over here is in the capsule form, whereas the seeds, they are endospermous seeds. So in this video, we have talked about how to represent the Lilacy family through the floral formula. I hope you have understood and liked this video. Thank you.